controller. I love video games, Xbox, PlayStation, Nintendo. And Sega, boy. Really don't matter to me, man. Who ready to play? Hold up, the game here got something to say. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy, God Shepherd, and I'm back. Oh, yeah with another video. I'm also a hip hop recording artist and all of that good old stuff and I hope you know where to go find my music. Anyway, let's get into this video, you guys. Uh, a friend of mine let me know that there is a PS VR 2 video up. So I wanted to check this thing out for myself. You guys already got it kind of pulled up here. So I wanna check this out and just get a glimpse of what it really looks like. I've seen some other stuff and some news on this a while back but I, I'm just gonna check it out fully right now. So, and you guys are gonna kind of see it with me. I'm sure you guys have seen it already, but here we go, let's check it out. Okay, now I remember the sticks and kind of this thing, the, the you know, the headset here. I'm, I'm digging the video so far, y'all. Yes. 4K HDR display! Eye, tr eye tracking? <laughs> Detection and follows your vision. Oh man, 110 degree field of view. <laughs> it detects your fingers, oh man, wow. Headset feedback, wow. Oh man. That's what I was wondering, would the haptics be inside of those controllers as well? Kinda like the dual sense. baby oh yeah now we just need to know when this thing is going to release uh, i don't know man maybe next year maybe maybe the holiday you know of 2022 maybe i don't know but my reaction to that is yeah that's that's awesome but i got one gripe one little gripe so far that i see from this because i've read up on some of it and things of that nature kind of saw what it could do but to see the video is a, it gives me a better perspective but as they were showing the vr man you know i got the original i got you know the psvr1 whatever you want to call it and the cord on the back how long is that cord going to be uh how much movement will we be able to have between our p5 or whatever and you know the headset from getting yanked off uh that's the only gripe that i think i got with this other than that it, it looks like it's going to be amazing the haptic feedback and plus if you get like bumped in the head or something and you feel that up inside of the headset as well oh that that that's great they, they're doing a lot with that I, I just think like why couldn't this thing be wireless if you guys can add all of that sony why couldn't it be wireless or if it may if it was wireless would that be considered its own separate type of console uh i, I just don't know because then you probably would have to have wi-fi to it and then you could probably get you a playstation plus subscription or whatever and be able to download games to it or or whatnot who, who knows but um yeah that's the only thing i mean why do we gotta have that cord on the back Oh man, I mean, and hopefully it's like a hundred feet or something that you can, something that you can move around with, man. Because I, I think you need to be able to move. 
you know, because with the old one, I don't think it gave us enough, uh, a, a long enough cord, if you will, to be able to move around. But other than that, I am excited for the PlayStation VR 2. How about you guys out there? Yeah, I, I can't wait. So make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and share, share your thoughts on the PSVR 2, and make sure you share this video. And don't forget to hit that bell button so you'll be notified when I'm doing new videos. Until next time, thank you guys for tuning in to Gamehead. Peace.